We talked about personal safety in our last video. Let's talk about something else that applies to our personal safety. You know that 68% of America is protected by the Volunteer Accommodation Fire Department. That means they're going to have less than 10 members on average showing up at a working fire. My department puts 27 members on scene in under six to nine minutes at a working fire. Does your department do that? Does your community have that many people coming to help you? I know many members that it's simply this. It's not two in, two out. It's two in, no one out, or two in, as my friend Kyle says, we put the fire out. So what happens when I have less people to do the same jobs that many departments who are blessed with staffing like my own has? I have to do the job better, more effectively, and you have to be a force multiplier. So how are you going to do that? Yeah, you can be Superman or Superwoman, but how about having a piece of technology that helps you do something that we haven't thought of before properly? I'm on the nozzle. I've got one firefighter coming in to join me, and I'm knocking the fire back, and that firefighter breaks off to do a search. This happens, as my friend Joey Baxter says, somewhere every day this is being done. How about that firefighter on the nozzle takes a quick look to see, yeah, I'm knocking it back. I'm making good progress. I can see those conditions changing. I can turn around and see my fellow firefighters making that hallway and suddenly has grabbed the victim. I can communicate for them. Victim, 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 located. Alpha Bravo corner, firefighter so-and-so is bringing the victim out. This doesn't get in my way. It's not a heavy, big anchor hanging on me because a nozzleman or a person pulling ceiling or grabbing a victim doesn't need other things in their hands. They need the tools and the task in their hand. This is a personal safety device to help them with that. Think about this, too. If I'm in there by myself on a line, I can see the convection currents pretty quickly coming down that hallway. What does that tell me? It tells me where the fire is and where the fire is going. We hear all the time, hey, I couldn't find a fire. You're reading line of duty death reports, a contributing factor. The firefighters had trouble finding the fire. With a simple diagnostic device like this, you can simply look and see where the fire is. Is this a decision-making camera? No, it's not but it's a diagnostic tool for personal safety known as situational awareness cameras. It helps me maintain situational awareness. It can help a firefighter alone on the nozzle maintain situational awareness. Is that worth your investment? You better believe it. Stay intelligently aggressive. We owe it to the citizen. We owe it to ourselves.